Hey, wahala. Guys, eh? Guys, eh? You see, when I say men will always tell you what they want to tell you, what they want you to know. Meanwhile, this lover wrote in Pidgin English, but I will interpret in English. This is an actress, so Wumi Toriola, as popular as she is, her husband wants to Colombi her. Oh. <laughs> this of her page, what this of her page cannot do. Hey, <laughs> no other blog can do it though. No other blogs can do it in fact. Anyways, let's dive into the cocoa of the day. Hello, Twe Twe. Yam Pepe scatter scatter. Oh. So some weeks ago, I posted the breakup news of actress Wumi Toriola's marriage. Now so one fine Igbo lady enter my DM begin question me say this man why post so he looks like her new man proposing marriage to her in fact the man don't they look for apartment for the two of them and say the man tell him say he he was never married because his girlfriend where him the date don't die hey so i was wondering and asked the lady if she sabi with me that's why Kuku be Omoibo. She know they watch Yoruba movies. So she talks, say, she knows Sabi how. Long story short, I shall tell the girl, make him send the man picture, make I compare. Now, so he sent Baba Zion picture, give me a ah, Baba Zion ke. Iba Zion are now, Wumi no die na. Why Baba Zion do like this? Now, so I tell that one, say, now the same man no, oh, that's why I come go fire him for WhatsApp. She shall confess, say, not true, but he already divorced the lady and they are no more together. Now so the lady come ask me, say, she making grief. A word need to me. She be na yopuna. Why is you asking me? Make we shall not talk plenty, sha. Now so the babaza yon begin talk, oh, begin narrate how wumi was doing basketballs in their marriage how wumi beat her mama and all now so iyawo ton ton come ask me again say she na true say the lady they do basketballs for inside her marriage hmm. now this of our blog nation go answer that one no my hand no day that one everyone she wumi they do basketballs for their marriage swipe to read the chat and in case you do not understand our local indigenous pidgin english what this lover was trying to say there is the other time he posted a picture of a couple and of course she's an actress you know trying to tell this lover blog nation that this their marriage has hit the rug before we could say jack robinson someone slided into this lover's blog nation's um, dm and was telling him that this man, who happens to be this Wumi Toriola's husband, is asking her out, you know, asking her to get married to him. And not only did the man ask her to marry him, he also lied to her that he had a girlfriend and the girlfriend is dead, which is the Wumi who is his wife. <laughs> so this lover asked the girl to send the picture of the man she is talking about and she sent it, lo and behold, the man happens to be the woman's husband. There and then this lover told her that no, Wumi is very much alive, that she's not dead in fact. So the girl needs to go back and, conf and tell the man, the woman's husband, that why are you lying? Your wife is still um, very much alive. Then... The man said, which is the woman's husband said, yes, she's alive, but they are divorced. That she was a kind of um, doing was was in their marriage and Wumi beat her mother up. So she's asking this lover or this lover blog nations, you know, they follow us. Should she accept the marriage proposal? If it's you, what will you do? You see the level, the level at which some people can go to get what they want so that is how this lady would have married this man with the hope that his wife is dead like guys without even knowing that she is the second wife eh? or she's she's getting married to a divorcee which might not be what she signed for she she wants for herself now wow 
Now, wow, that's why it's good to ask questions. Ask questions, it gets why. Anyways, this lover went ahead to show the chat he or she had with this lady that slided into his or her DM for confirmation. So, here is the chat. Here are the chats, rather. So, um, this person she chats this lover up, and here are the conversations. And, um, good day, wanted to ask you something. Ayo is disturbing me of marriage. Funny part, he never told me he was married until I saw it post few weeks ago. And um, told me he wants us to get married, but I have always refused because it's too fast and more like fake for me only to see your post some weeks ago and I was wondering. So after the chat she had with this lover, she went straight to meet some um, husband for confrontation and here are their chats. So the guy said, good evening, beautiful. How has your day been? How are you feeling now? Hope better. Been busy with this honest sorry with the house hunt and the girl said fine oh how are you the guy said fine the girl said nice so you said your first marriage has how many keys and the guy said one and the man asked her this is the second time you've asked um you're asking about this then she replied cause when we saw um you never said you are married never did you mention any child I'm asking to be sure you will respond if you have one or not because you never mentioned it. And the guy said, because I have a son now, guess it's an issue or is there something you aren't telling me? Then the girl replied, the issue is you never mentioned you were married before. When, you, when we spoke, you talked about you've been single and that you lost your girlfriend so i'm wondering why not say i'm married but divorced or what have you and the guy replied well i had an ugly past but have got a son then she said you never said you were once married sorry we are once yes married guess that's what she wanted to say no I had a child why not say it at once then he said apologies she now smiled tell me about the story and the guy said it's a sad one all i can say is it was full of violence deceit and betrayal and um nothing fantastic about it and um, betrayal from who the girl asked violence from who deceit from who and the guy replied all from her she hits my mom and the girl said mm. so the girl screenshot their wedding picture with me some husband uh, wedding picture with me and sent it to him and um she asked this lady he said yes so what's the whole story was surprised to see the post and i was wondering what went wrong because this what went wrong because the this man looks like some i have been talking to and the guy said no story to tell nothing else to say was a total regret and the girl asked from her or you um the guy said yeah you see the way the lady was so relaxed you know the whole confrontation and everything it shows that the lady in question is in love oh. she's in love like hey, hey the guy don't sweep off her feet like she she has nowhere else to go anyways you see eh, this life this life things they happen oh, we learn every day by day my own is eh, why lying to this girl so had it been this girl did not confront this lover eh? had it been this girl did not tell this lover she doesn't know that this man was once married though and eh? had it been she wasn't open uh, open to this lover and at, at the long run both of them gets married before you know now her picture will be plastered all over the internet any of them now and people can can do undo they may even lie against the girl eh ha now wow hmm. women eh be very very careful oh. be very very careful ladies of ladies of these days before you get married san nagi miri wash your eye very very well soak it inside water Huh? Remove contact lens, remove eyelashes, remove every makeup that you wear on your eyes before saying I do with that man. Do your own secret investigations. He gets why. Anyways, guys, with that being said, that brings me to the end of this video. Please, if you're watching for the first time, 
this is Ladley Woman on Court. Do me that favor by subscribing to my YouTube channel and turn on your notification bell to always get notified anytime I drop new video or videos. On this channel, we react, we analyze, we give friendly celebrity news, true crime and true crime stories. And to my tiny subscribers, of course, you all know that this video can never be complete without me appreciating you guys. Thank you for always watching, liking, commenting and sharing. I do not take that for granted. Bye bye for now as I'm signing out for my next one. Peace out. Love you all. Kemesiano.